going strong. Michael J. Fox and wife of 29 years, Tracy Pollan cuddle up at Herbo premiere of Rolling Stone documentary. The Herbo documentary Rolling Stone. Stories from the Edge about the rise of the eponymous magazine had a premiere in New York on Monday. Michael J. Fox and his wife Tracy Pollan, who next year will celebrate their 30th wedding anniversary, posed on the black carpet at the event. Marking a blue check blazer over a black button-down shirt, Michael, 56, elegantly clashed a pair of dark, faded jeans with gleaming black shoes. Meanwhile, Tracy, a 57-year-old actress of family ties fame, played up her enviably trim legs in a pair of skin-tight black trousers that matched her black shoes. She had draped herself in an intricately patterned navy, white and rust-colored floral blouse, accessorizing with a glinting medallion necklace. Journalist in the bonfire of the vanities author Tom Wolfe wore his off-white trousers laughably high, most of the way up his stomach, at the bash. The 86-year-old's bottoms were part of a suit, which he had garnished with a gold-trimmed white pocket square. Grasping an eye-popping cane topped with a carving of a dog's head, he wore a tie that featured a swirl of gold and white over a navy field. His dress shirt had an air of the nautical about it, navy and white stripes, though its elegantly curved collar was entirely white. CBS This Morning hostess Nora O'Donnell had tucked an elegant wave-battened blue blouse into a pristine pair of high-waisted black trousers. Meanwhile, iconic fashion designer Vera Wang was a knockout in a black blazer buttoned over a glinting floor-length white gown. Vera teamed the look with a pair of drop earrings and a pendant. Caitlin Maynard's black leather jacket had white fuzz lining its collar and cuffs, and she posed alongside her blazer-wearing fiancé, Danny Strong. Blair Foster and Alex Gibney have narrated the two-part doc, which Jeff Daniels has narrated, according to her beau. Rolling Stone report that November 6th and November 7th will be the film's broadcast dates.